In part one of the Stack Compiler tutorial video series, we learned to create a basic table. In part two, we will customize our table. Here is our table of current use of modern methods of contraception in Eastern Africa. To get more information about the indicator we selected, click on the I icon next to the indicator name. The indicator details box includes a more detailed definition, the type of measure, and the denominator. We can also customize the contents of the table to meet our needs. The default table includes all of the surveys from the countries we have selected. The survey selector box is found below the data table. Users might prefer to see the most recent survey in each country to get an idea of the current status of family planning use. Or you may have a specific time period in mind. By selecting Custom, you will be able to manually select or deselect any survey from your table. For today's example, let's keep our selection of the most recent survey in each country. You can sort your data from low to high or high to low with the arrows in the column heading. Looking at our table, we notice that the data for Eritrea, Madagascar, and Sudan are not current. To deselect these countries, go to the Countries panel at the lower right corner and uncheck the circles for these countries. This is also where we can add other countries without starting over by clicking on the pencil icon. Now that we have the desired list of surveys, we can add background characteristics. The full list of available background characteristics is provided under the indicators box and will vary based on the indicator selected. For our example, we might want to know if modern contraceptive use increases with a woman's education. By checking the circle next to education, columns are added to the table to show modern method use for each educational level. At any point, you can also add a new indicator to your table by clicking the pencil icon in the indicator box. To add unmet need for family planning to our table, simply search, check the appropriate circle, and click OK. To see modern method use and unmet need side by side, deselect education. The Options tab lets you further customize your table. You can change the orientation of your table by placing the indicators in the rows, for example. You can also add denominators, either weighted or unweighted. If you are building a table that is a percent distribution, this is where you can add the special values, that is, the don't knows and missing. Once you are happy with your table, you have several options for exporting or sharing it. You can export it in a table format for use in Excel or in a database format. You can also share your table. The Share option captures a customized URL of your table, which includes the countries, indicators, and background characteristics selected. You can share via Twitter, Facebook, email, or copy the link and save for another time. To learn how to visualize these data in column charts, line graphs, and maps, continue to Part 3 in the Stack Compiler video tutorial series.